Hi, I'm Shanika with Comprehensive Grants Management and today I'll be covering the topic of the Job Plus MOU requirements. So not to keep you long, I'm just going to go right ahead and jump into it. So the applicants must establish and maintain a working relationship with the Local Workforce Development Board and or Local American Job Center. This is actually a statutory requirement for the Job Plus program. To meet the threshold requirement, the applicant must submit documentation of this relationship in the form of a MOU between the Public Housing Authority and the Local Workforce Development Board or the American Job Center. Additionally, the MOU must identify roles and responsibilities of the signature agencies as it pertains to the program and how the Workforce Innovation and Opportunity Act funds will be used to support the Jobs Plus program at the targeted project for the grant term. The MOU must include a description of the local employment market with information related to skills and training for in-demand jobs. Also, please note if that cannot be extended in the MOU, they will accept an additional narrative to that. The MOU must have been signed by all parties between the date of publication of this NOFO and the application due date. If there is an if there is an MOU that is already in existence, what you have to do here, the parties must execute an addendum that specifically references the Jobs Plus program for the fiscal year 2023. What it will ha also have to reflect is the criteria that I just mentioned and it will also have to meet the, the date requirements. So when submitting, what you'd have to do is the MOU that is already in existence will also have to be added to the addendum in your application. So you can just pay attention to that. And thank you so much for listening. Have a great one.